So as some of you will know, uh, a little while ago, I, after having the aircon fitted, I came out of a and &E Leisure down the road. The, the roadwork's being done, so I was sort of pushed over to one side and the mirror actually caught a branch of a tree and really whacked it. Um, I was doing about 20, 25 miles an hour um, and it really whacked it in, put a hole in the uh, the mirror cowling and um, I reported that on a vlog uh, as we do and some very kind people you guys suggested that I should buy some mirror protectors I went for well I found some I found some online uh, for about 120 pounds uh, other people suggested that I should go for the Milenko for about um, 50 50 pounds 50 60 pounds so I found them online um, at Amazon for I think it's about uh, 58 5875 something like that I'll put a link in the description below uh, so that you can you can go and buy those if you want to um, I will say all the links to things that we have and we own and we recommend are affiliate links so Amazon will pay me about two pennies uh, every time you buy something or I don't know what it is um, <laughs> They, they, they pay me a commission as with all affiliate links but um, I've got them I've actually put one on I haven't clamped it on yet but I wanted to make this video of putting these on but I wanted to show you the quality of them here here is the um, near side one so that will that sort of clips over and there's this bit here which actually you need to force past the lip and that sits there and the clamp this clamp goes on this side like so so that and there's two screw holes there and there um, but the 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 instructions for fitting them are actually on the outside of the box so the instructions are one get the thing two clip it over and you'll see um, that's where you need to force it over the edge of the mirror. Three, push it on tight. Four, put the clamp on and then use a screwdriver to screw it together. Five, uh, six, <laughs> six is not really instruction, it's done. So, uh, but it, nice, it nicely balances the box up with six on, so I don't blame them for putting that there. But as for the quality, they look, they look, I mean, they look and feel pretty lightweight, and maybe that's a good thing. They are very flexible, and I think that's probably supposed to be. If they, you know, if you can't bend it and break it, then it's probably going to take quite a bit of impact before it goes and breaks the original cowling for your vehicle. So maybe that's a good thing. Um, you do get a bit of um, you do get a bit of padding, but it's so tiny thin to put on the inside. But let's go and fit those on the vehicle now. So here we are with the uh, driver side um, that's been sort of clipped on, so it's been out in the rain. But you'll see that this one came already with this pad fitted. So, you know, I'm wondering whether this has been out <laughs> in the in the wild before, but I'm just going to go and clip this on and then put the clamp on. So you see it comes with um, one for each side and there's this lip that goes on around there, but I simply sort of push on. That sort of really needs a bit of a, a bit of a push to get that on there then that's that's fixed on so what happens next is that this uh, clamp goes in here and there's two screws that go one at the top and one at the bottom there you go pretty simple job 
and that's the first one uh, fitted and you'll see it stands out quite nicely although I think it's going to really show up the marks um, and maybe getting the white one wasn't such a great idea but I think it does stand out and they look pretty smart I think let's fit the other one so here we are this one doesn't have the little uh, protector pad on the inside so I'm just gonna that's a simple sort of peel off and then stick that on the on the inside there about the same place as the as the other one um, that came with it already attached as I say, you know, I think maybe these have been out to a customer before and they'd return them after sticking one of the pads on and see that the pads actually weren't that thick. Maybe. Um, but again, this is going to be sort of fairly simple to fit. It just goes on. So I think the quality on these is is not brilliant. I mean, you know, they do. I think they'll do their job, but um, when you see this, there's the, this gap round here, and I think the more expensive ones had a, a sort of a seal all the way round, and it had much bigger padding on the inside. Um, I know rain rain will probably get in to this to these gaps here, but it will obviously run downwards and it does have a, a sort of drain hole in the bottom so here it is already fitted uh, one on the driver's side and one on the passenger side looking pretty smart I think much better than the black ones I'll see you again soon bye bye <laughs>